Hey guys, LEGO World War 2 Reviews here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys my Brick Arms prototype collection. And on Skype, I have uh, a friend of mine. Hello guys, it's me, LEGO Maniac. Please go check out my channel, I'm sure Cuddy will put a link Yeah, I'll put a, I'll put a link in the description down below. Or the description that works best. Uh, so yeah, uh, I'd just like to say... Check out my channel, keep watching Cody's videos, and, um, yeah. Alright, but, alright, I'm just gonna put you on mute. Alright, um, anyway, as you guys can see, I believe I have 40 prototypes here. So, um, I'm just gonna start from left to right here. Alright, as you can see, here is the, uh, Spike Bat prototype. Very cool prototype. I'm just going to go through these very quickly so it isn't a really long video. Here's the prototype M1917, which I think I did a review on a while back. Here's a prototype uh, short shot flintlock pistol. Here's a prototype golden gun. Uh, a, here's a destiny hand cannon. Uh, I have two of those in black. And then two in olive green as well. And then here's a mortar shell, a short shot uh, gold arc, a quantum spanner and overmolded glow in the dark and gunmetal, a rusted magazine. I'm not sure if you can see that there. But yeah, that's rust. And then a glow in the dark uh, I forget what they call this, but it's some sort of artillery shell. Um, 20 millimeter grenade, I believe, in blue. <coughs> Sorry about that. Here is a uh, time bomb. Very cool. Um, a Destiny overmolded, um, I believe Will calls it the overkill. It's basically just a machine gun. <coughs> Sorry about that. But uh, here's a one in olive and black. A, dark bluish gray and black, olive green, I know, these are, these are fusion rifles by the way, these two, olive green, black, two of the version 2 hand cannons in black, so that's cool, a black UCS, um, a white XBR4, a sticky, de de uh, sticky detonator, or XLMD, I believe Will calls it. A uh, trans orange with gold speckles, XBR3. <coughs> a brown and black Sark. Uh, Overmolded XM41, which I did a review on, so that's pretty cool. A black XSR. <coughs> Sorry. A overmolded RPD. Two overmolded vectors, a black and gunmetal, and one blue, rust, and black. Now onto my World War II prototypes. A uh, overmolded PPSH. <coughs> Two version 1 PPSHs off the sprue. They both have magazines. A gunmetal bar 42. An SVT 40 in brown. A uh, dark bluish gray flamethrower. And then onto my last prototypes here. As you can see, here is a version 1 PPSH sprue. So that's pretty cool. And then also, last, and I think this is the best, an Arasaka and brown. And it's also got a gunmetal swirl there. I'll go ahead and take it out of its bag. I just keep it in the bag, that way I don't accidentally bend the blade or something. Let me just focus there. But yeah, there's a little gunmetal in there. So yeah, very, very cool prototype. I really, really like that one. And let me just put it back in its bag. There we go. But yeah, that that's pretty much my prototype collection. So yeah, also expect in newer videos in about a week to have a new intro um so that would be really cool i will upload a video of the intro once the guy that i'm getting it done from gets it done so i'll upload a video of that sometime 
maybe in the coming week or so. And yeah, it will look amazing, I'll tell you guys that much. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm going to go ahead and unmute uh, Lego Maniac here. Alright, so you can talk. I think he might have muted his mic. I'm sorry. You still there? Okay, so, um, I think he muted his mic. That's, uh, that's pretty much it for no, this. I'm, I'm here. I'm here. Sorry. <laughs> Alright, uh, go Do you have any last words to say? That sounds like a hefty prototype collection there. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Go check out my channel. Link is below. Bye. Link is in the description. That's pretty much it for this video, guys. Be sure to like. If, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one.